delicious and lose weight with Chef Pachi. Hi, this is Chef Pachi, and today I have a delicious recipe of sweet potatoes and hummus. And it can be part of a meal and it can be an appetizer as well as some finger food. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna cut our sweet potatoes in half inch rounds. Once we have them all sliced, we are almost ready to go. We are gonna place these sweet potato slices in a baking pan and we're gonna sprinkle them with Chinese five spice powder. This is a delicious mix of spices that you're gonna love. And when it bakes, it comes out beautiful. Now, sweet potatoes take a while to bake, but they're beautiful, lightly golden and delicious, and they make amazing finger foods. If you're gonna use them as finger foods, try and buy some that are not so big, so that each slice is less wide. Sprinkle your sweet potatoes with a pinch of salt if you want to. It doesn't have to be a lot, but it actually brings out some of the sweetness in the sweet potatoes. A dash of pepper, and we are almost ready to go. We're gonna bake these sweet potatoes with some fresh sage. And this is gonna be beautiful because the sage dries out during the baking process and it becomes crispy and delicious gives the aroma that you wouldn't believe when you bite into each one of these slices. Now, let's bake them for about 35 minutes at 350 degrees. Look at them, they are beautiful while they bake and when they come out, even your children are gonna fight for them. They're gonna love them, amazing. Look at the beautiful sage leaves, how they dry out. And we're gonna pick one for each one of our slices because we wanna bite into those delicious sage leaves. Now we're gonna create our delicious hummus spread. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix half a cup of hummus, half a cup of Greek yogurt, a tiny bit of pepper, and a teaspoon of dark sesame oil. This is gonna be a beautiful and delicious spread for each one of our sweet potato slices. This is actually a great dip if you want for vegetables because it becomes higher in protein and it's also easier to spread, delicious and very, very light. Look at it, it mixes in seconds and you have a perfect dish. So here we go. Each one of our slices has one of those dried sage leaves. But here we go, we're placing a tablespoon of Pashi hummus with each one of our sweet potato slices. So this is what I was telling you. If you're gonna do it as finger food and you buy smaller and thinner sweet potatoes, it's gonna be easier. If you're having it as an appetizer or side dish or entree sitting down, what you would do is get the thicker sweet potatoes. Now we're gonna add a dash of our five spice powder at the end to make the dish more beautiful and flavor it a little more. We pass it through a sieve and voila, we are done. An amazing appetizer side special for any occasion. Remember, with Shepachi, delicious diets are sustainable diets. Subscribe and turn on the bell for recipe updates.